Welcome back to the Odyssey, my friends. I am Mike Odyssey, and in this video, I'm going to do something that no one has been able to do so far, and it's confirmed two major features for Nintendo Switch 2 with 100% accuracy. This is backwards compatibility and the Nintendo Switch 2 screen size. I will prove to you in this video with legal documents this is coming. If you are new here, watch this clip, and if not, use the timestamp below. So before we get into today's stories, you see, I want to ask you one thing. I want to ask for your subscription. You see, I am legally blind, and I'm basically losing my sight uh, as we go. I don't have sight on my left eye, and I have about 40% sight of my right eye, and it's just fading away, right? The doctors right now have nothing else they can do, but I have a dream to become a full-timer on youtube by the end of this year and i i'm going to ask you for your help uh if you subscribe to this channel right now it'll only take a second for me it'll just change my life so if you could do that right now i would really appreciate it here we have monday through friday nintendo news on the weekends we have products and reviews and we also have the occasional and topic podcast with your favorite voice actor so i would really appreciate it it will mean the world to me and i just want to Thank you in advance for giving me your subscription. Let's move on to today's stories. All right, so let's start right here with this patent, okay? Because in this patent is the proof that backwards compatibility is a thing. And this patent right here, even though it seems like it's for a Nintendo Switch game, it's actually for backwards compatibility. And it tells us when Nintendo started working on basically updating their games so that they are compatible with the nintendo switch 2 okay now let's go over this patent real quick it was issued on march 12 2024 but here you can see that it was filed on october 6 2021 okay this is a patent from 2021 because it is for the game mario golf super rush okay and it was uh released on june 25th 2021 now we got that out of the way it is for a game that has already been out so it has to be if we're talking about backwards compatibility right so now where we go here in this uh video game here the first thing we have to notice is that uh, we're talking about here the actual game and and if we see here in the drawings we see the first drawing of the game mario here the actual uh mario super rush uh, little images and everything but one thing we have to notice is that it says perimeter determination screen okay so every little detail here is confirming something on screen right here and it looks like it's being moved around right it's being kind of rearranged in order to fit well so we have here that the cloud we have uh the little uh thing there we got the character 302 and and everything else right it goes with with with, with everything and so if we scroll down, Nintendo has is, is nice enough to let us know, wait, this is the Nintendo Switch game. Look, it's for the Nintendo Switch. So they're telling us this game is for the Nintendo Switch. We already know that. And as we scroll down, we see that there, there's a Nintendo Switch there. And they go on by kind of giving us everything of the Nintendo Switch, which if you ask me, it's a little bit unnecessary. This is the, the processor for the Switch. These are the controllers, the Joy-Cons. And then we go back to the image, right? And perimeter, determination, screen now if you're like me you've already noticed that there's something weird about this the screen right the size why is it is the size that big it doesn't really look like it fits within the actual switch how about we solve that right now and let's go ahead and go over to photoshop right i've already gone ahead and done this right here i take the the actual image and we have the image of the screen and we have the actual screen size of the game. And well, there is one of the rumors out there that tells us we are getting a bigger screen, an eight inch screen to be to be exact. And this eight inch screen will be able to give us games in 1080p. And so right here, let's go ahead and put this image over the, the, the regular model first, the Nintendo Switch. And as you can see here, it doesn't really go together, right? If we can resize it just a little bit more, just to go ahead and hit the mark. Look at this. There's still this line over here and this this extra screen here. So in order for us to get an, ac an actual accurate representation, we have to make it a little bigger and make it fit the size, all right? And so 
this itself will tell us how bigger the Nintendo Switch screen on Nintendo Switch 2 will be. You can see it right there and the extra screen down this way. So the actual Nintendo Switch 2 will be a little bigger, you know, a little bigger when it comes to the, the height, the height of it. And because the screen itself is going to be higher and not wider than the actual Nintendo Switch. In order to give us that those eight inches of screen from here down to here. So from here to here is eight inch right there. And so the screen will be a lot of, a lot bigger. But you, you might ask, Mike, have you tried this with the Nintendo Switch OLED? Well, how about we do that right now? Take a look here. We have a Nintendo Switch OLED. And so we can do the same exact thing here. Uh, let me go ahead and put this switch right below. And then we'll take this, this screen right here. And we'll do the same thing. We'll resize it and we'll put it over the Nintendo Switch. And that way we can go ahead and measure it, right? Put it right there. And let's go ahead and measure it, but this way. And as you can see here, let's bring it down a little more. Same thing. The same thing applies, even though it's just a little bit less. But still, there is just a little more on top. And it, it makes sense because this is a 7-inch screen. And this will make it 8-inch. Okay, so there you have the proof. Nintendo is actually working on backwards compatibility and making every game compatible with the Nintendo Switch to so make sure that, the, that the, the, the actual games from Switch actually fit on the 8-inch screen. It's, it's, it's a different type of real estate, guys, because this is a 7-inch screen, right? 720p when it comes to resolution. And so it starts here ends there but in order to make it a 1080p on on an h h screen you have to make it taller and that's why it is taller okay as you can see here it's describing the perimeter uh determination screen 300 and we have all the little uh tweaks that have been made and let's go ahead and make this a little fuller here so you guys can see the design that is basically on top of the nintendo switch oled screen and that tells you exactly how big or how tall the switch will be. So we'll probably have bigger joy cons as well, bigger controllers, and it'll go, it'll come up to here, right? This, this much more of a bigger system we're going to get with the Nintendo switch Two. And so right now, believe it or not, this is the most credible resource we have. Why? Because this is a Nintendo switch game. Right? It's not a patent for a, a system or it's not a patent for just anything else. This is a patent for an update for a Nintendo Switch game. And what they're doing is making it compatible with the Nintendo Switch 2 by rearranging everything and adjusting the parameters so that everything fits well within an 8-inch screen. So that comes with an update. Let's say you, you, you start the game on a, on a regular switch the system knows and it reads the game in order to make it fit on the screen and now what they're doing is updating the system so that it does the same thing for nintendo switch 2. you you, you insert the game or you download the game and the system knows what perimeter to use in order to make it fit on the screen for the 8 inch oled or lcd screen we will get on the nintendo switch 2. um guys i want to bring you the best and most up-to-date information. I want to make sure that it, it is not leaks, it's not rumors, it's actually tangible, real information straight from the horse's mouth, straight from Nintendo to get you excited for the next-gen system. And guys, this is the best video you can find out there that tells you, yes, Nintendo is giving us a bigger screen. This is more than, more than confirmation. This is straight from nintendo and i i'm not sure if they thought it through but here they are actually giving us the proof okay they're giving us the proof that yes they are working on a bigger eight inch screen which tends to be a little taller in order to for it to give us that 1080 uh, p screen resolution on handheld mode and then hopefully we'll get that 4k um and uh screen on in, in dock mode right so here we have it that is um what i did here for you guys to show you guys yes this is a switch 2 um patent hidden within the switch nintendo switch uh you know thing because right there what they're doing is actually 
the perimeter determination screen. They're talking, they're working on the screen size for this game that has been out for Nintendo Switch already. Thus confirming, yes, my friends, backwards compatibility is a thing, and we will see it come to Nintendo Switch 2 whenever Nintendo decides to launch a console, whether it's this year or next year in 2025. I'll, I'll, I'll continue to be Team 2024 until, t until the year 2024 ends. All right, my friends, let me know what you guys think about this, this discovery here. You want to see more about this, please subscribe, hit the like button, make sure to support the channel so that I can continue to bring you guys videos just like this one. I am now full time on YouTube. This is my only uh, only job. So if you would love to support the channel, consider becoming a member. Consider asking a question by hitting the super thanks little heart and I can read this quarter of the questions in the next video thank you guys so much for for watching i'll see you in the next one before i let you go never give up and journey on peace